I am way overdue for this video. This is the head of my Dyson V15. It's currently disgusting. But with a little splash of Fabuloso and some elbow grease, I'm gonna whip this baby back into shape. Just right after a haircut. Okay, so some of it is mine, but most of it belongs to Teddy. Now, I never used to clean my vacuum before I bought this one. But that is exactly what happens when you buy a vacuum that's $700. Listen, I don't have any regrets. But the thought of that price tag still makes me want to vomit. Almost as much as the dirty surprises hidden in here. Let me be very clear. You do not need this ridiculously priced machine to have a clean home. But if you don't own own a cordless vacuum, then what are you waiting for? So most of what you're paying for is convenience. And I will do anything to make cleaning more convenient for me. But also I'm a sucker for Dyson. And capitalism, I'll admit it. So yeah, the vacuum's great and everything works like a dream, but this is where I messed up. Well, I think I'm just scrubbing paint stains off the vacuum. I was actually scratching the plastic. Yeah, I'm gonna take the L on this one. Okay, but nobody panic. It still works perfectly. We'll just call it a design change. And now let me present to you the reason why I have to vacuum every single day. Yes, my house is dirty, but also the laser is so cool. Ooh, that's nasty.